Right, I'm just starting a recording here. I'm going to be playing this Katara Bullet Arena. This is one minute bullet, an hour and a half long. Not sure how much of it I'm going to play yet. Depends how it goes, I guess. And this is qualifying round one of two. I'm only playing in this first one. Um, it's a rather strong field. My rating here is 2265. That's my best ever bullet rating. Normally I'm about 100 points below that. Maybe 2150 to 2200. That's my kind of comfortable range. Any time in bullet or blitz I'm over 2200, I'm kind of stretching myself a little bit. So I'm much more likely to go down than up. You can see I'm currently number 436 out of 2179 players. If I could finish in the top 6 or 700, I'll have done pretty well here. And this is what I mean when you look at the field. Oddly enough, Penguin has registered himself twice because that's they're both Andrew Tang's accounts. His main traditional account and his C9 account. Spicy Caterpillar, that's Ray Robson. Sergei Zhigalko is a 3000, does very well consistently. Uh, Pragnanand is playing in this. Look at the, all the field that you've got. T title player, title player. Azuri, that is Super Grandmaster Shaq Mamadiarov. So if you get an unlucky draw in this, it, as any amateur player, any of us who are amateurs, non-title players, you get an unlucky draw, you can easily play the best chest you will ever play, the best bullet chest you'll ever play, and yet still lose virtually every game. You know, And then you, if you do hit an unlucky streak, you can end up tilting and then lose games that you wouldn't normally lose as well, and it can really go downhill rapidly. But when you look at how strong everybody is here, it's just about the fun of taking part and enjoying the experience. And you might get the odd game against these elite players. You might do... I mean, it's unlikely I'll get any games with any against these superstar players because they'll be in a little league of their own, I would guess. But yeah, if I could finish in the top six or seven hundred, assuming I actually play the full hour and a half or close to it, I think I'll have done pretty well. If my Ten, rating's 2150 nine, at eight, the end, I'll seven, have done pretty well because I really am at my limits five, here. So four, three, Just bump the sound up two, slightly so I can one, hear the moves on the ball. Zero. So good luck, everybody. Let's hope it all goes well. So. 2262, good luck. Let's play a Karo. And of course, if any, if a lot of my opponents are a lot younger than me, they might well be naturally much quicker with the mouse. I'm never really very quick with my mouse in terms of the physical movements of it. So I tend to rely more on winning games through playing a decent game rather than playing them quickly. Let's push there. It's just castle. Uh, I think I'll push. Uh, I'm going to drop knight back now and look to trade the bishop. Um, let's play a pawn up. Maybe rook across here, maybe not. Let's go knight forward, knight across. I'm going to push a pawn there. Don't know if it's good or bad, but I've got a dark square to plop the rook on. Um, okay, I'm going to take there, then knight across and maybe back. Let's take there as well. He's got a choice of pawns, but can I sack here? Let's play a knight up. I should have grabbed the pawn, I guess. Go G5. Well, I meant to go on the dark square there. That was careless. Wow, he hung his queen. Very lucky. Started with a win, so another personal best rating. Very lucky, but that's what I mean. I can play a decent game at my amateur level. Two, three, one, eight. Good luck, but that's how I rely on winning games. I'm just not quick with the mouse. Okay, I'll take the pawn. Just give it back. As 
long as I can move the knight somewhere, I'll trade the queens, I think. Just play a bishop up there. Knight in is covered. Blundered a pawn, I've just realised what I've done. Threatening to double his pawns at least there, let's push. How the hell am I so far up on the clock? Oh, he's disconnected, that's how. Has he got an internet issue? He's just abandoned the game. Okay, still going to focus here, but let's keep the piece on the board because he's so low on time. Oh my goodness, I blundered a repetition. How the heck did that end in a draw? I didn't think that was a repetition, but it's given it. At least I didn't lose it, but that should have been a win. Right, 1768, good luck. He loses the queen. Yeah, he just resigns. Oh, let's hope I don't draw a penguin. I've played penguin once before in Arena Kings in Blitz, but clearly, with the best one in the world, I can't handle a player like that in Bullard. Right, 2556, five, good luck. there I think. Giving him a chance of an outside pass there, he doesn't go for it. I'm going to try and push. If Bishop in Rook across, okay let's just push. I'm threatening a check to win the Rook. Um, let's hit the Bishop then. If he takes it to check, so I need to take back. Um, let's just bishop up and rook across, I think. Just abandon the outside. Oh no, if he takes, I take his rook, of course. I've actually gone into a bit of a mess here, haven't I? So this is definitely lost. He has to actively mess this up now. Okay, I can take that back, so that's a safe pre-move. Oh, he's blundered a stalemate as well. Wow. All right, two six twenty. Good luck. Let's 
play something bold here. Oh, I've got to be careful there, don't I? Be very careful about this pawn. Yeah, and I'm going to sack. Oh, I didn't see that. I simply didn't see it. Yeah, I think I'll just give him that one. Not a bad start though, is it? Not a bad start. Where am I? The tournament's that busy, it's taken a while to update, but 2081, good luck. I need to try and get as many opponents as possible to go berserk, don't I? And give me as much time as I can. Well, let's just go conservative here. Well, I'm going to attack now. Might be just fine and dandy there. Well, I've blundered check, but not mate. Night covers. I'm trying to play this. Point one of a second. That's what I mean. You can see I'm naturally not a quick, quick player. So I can only win games if I get doing well like that and actually find a finish on the board. But boy, right, 24 or 7, good luck. I thought he might have just sacked there and taken. Where do I put my bishop? Mm, I think I need to go on the diagonal. Let's play queen up and back. I'm trying to push this pawn. Okay, I'll just take and push. Okay, now his bishop is really bad.
Done another one. Done another one. Unbelievable. This is unbelievable, isn't it? Is that 22? 85. What is going on? Unreal. I'm just going to give myself the odd little 10, 20, 30 seconds between games. Unreal. Wow. Mm. Imagine me trying to tackle any of these really strong players. I mean, I'm still not playing anywhere near the standard to do that. I don't know, was I there? I clicked on somebody else. Right, 24.49, good luck. Let's play an early C5. Let's play a knight up. I think I'd better develop there. I'm in trouble with my queen here, actually, aren't I? It's off of the queen trade. I'm in a tinsy winsy spot of bother this game, I think, but it's all good fun. Oh, he had the pin there, didn't he? But yeah, I'm just lost here anyhow. Yeah, see, I couldn't play quick enough. I couldn't play quick enough there. Unbelievable. Mm. That was a loss because techni technically I can self-mate because he has a bishop. Mm. At least I'm playing well, though, aren't I? Playing well. For my rating. That's I mean, if I could finish in the top six, 700, I'd be doing really, really well. Like, seriously well. 2242, good luck. Yeah, those players who are blessed with a really quick mouse are just a bit too much for me to handle. Oops, he's gone a bit quick. Mm, let's drop back out of that. Mm, let's play a rook across. I probably should have fixed it, actually. Shouldn't have. That was silly. Let's do that now. I just missed that. But pawn if I've got a knight block herder. Let's drop black. He should have taken the knight first, I think, there. He's hung the queen. Oh, I thought he'd hung his queen. He hasn't I've hung checkmate. Hmm. Well done. I thought he'd hung his queen, I just missed it. But I'm going to make mistakes like that. Well done. We're playing a woman's international master. 2 to 80. Good luck. Okay. Okay, what's that attack there? Mm, like queen up. Hmm. Let's play knight forward. 
I'm actually threatening to capture a pawn here because of the pin. Which way do I want to take though? Well, I can still take. Just go back. square there that was really silly terribly silly oh she might flag herself That's a cracking good win, isn't it? Cracking good win against an international master. A woman's international master. <coughs> really good, wow. So I'm just inside the top 500. So I mean, this field is so strong. I mean, look at the leaders here. 9.99, good luck. Okay, going berserk. I need everybody to go berserk, really. Push there. You gotta move, you've gone berserk, so you just gotta move. Just resigned, yeah. 2274, good luck, Fido Master. You can actually take there, but I'm not going to do it here. Let's play a knight across. Let's play a queen up. Actually, I don't know why I did that. That's a bad move, isn't it? That's a terrible move. Let's play a knight up. I think that is playable, although which one? Has to be this one, I think. Okay, let's play H5. Hmm. I've gone horrifically slow here. Yeah, this is just over, isn't it? That was just very, very poor, very poor, but I'm doing really well overall. All right, 2068, good luck. I'm tempted to actually stop my recording and switch to live streaming, but I can't really live stream bullet chess, I don't think. Okay, let's just take... Queen up. Oh, I've just invited the knight in now. Now the bishop down. Maybe I'll I can take that. I'm going to try and push at the right moment. Let's play a bishop up. Try and gain some space here. Take a few risks, why not? Make sure I've given my king a square. And I'll get adventurous. Okay, I'll take a draw, well done. Decent result for both of us there. Right, 
my 2114, good luck. Look to remove the defending bishop. Okay, let's take and take. Now it's a pawn. Um, let's give him the bishop. Hmm. Let's play a queen up. Yeah, I can't actually defend it. It's a bad, bad way I've played this. Let's just take. I've given my opponent all the initiative here. Hmm. I can't actually keep the pawn, can I? Oh, I've got to give him a free rook. Just give him a free rook there, I lost my mind. 2226, two, two, good luck. Oh, I've blundered the bishop. It's a free bishop. I didn't see it. He actually had a free bishop, he just didn't see it. Gotta be ready in case he offers a queen trade here, otherwise take. draw there didn't I? He's got a repetition. He had one anyway. Nothing I could do there. I was aware I was really a long way down on the clock. So, I mean, my mouse speed is simply not quick enough to compete with these players who are genuinely quick. Right, 12, oh, got a 1221 doing this well. Mm, let's hope this is legit. Good luck though. But yeah, 1200 doing that well makes you wonder. Take and take there. There is a pawn hanging, but more important to get safe first. He can't castle, of course, right now. Maybe his rating is legit. He's just done unbelievably well for his rating. Pin threat. So he has to block. Oh, I've hung my queen. Oh, God. He had a free queen. Oh. I was just lost there. Gave him a free queen. Oh, my goodness. He'll be kicking himself. Unbelievable. My first cataclysmic blunder. Just gave him a free queen. Again, he gave me a piece there. I've seen it this time. OK, 
Okay, we get there in the end, but boy, I hung a queen, didn't I? Oh. Maybe I'm just starting to lose my concentration a bit, but... <coughs> right, 2085, good luck. Now let's play a bold again this time. Okay, let's just push. can't take cut, I don't think, because he gets mated. Doesn't he get mated? He has to block one or the other. I think that's checkmate. One or the other. So a bit fortunate with that one. I'm not going to play bold games like that very often. Just for variety's sake. But yeah, 499th and I'm doing really well. 2248, good luck. And there's still an hour of this to go. How these top players play at their you know, game after game for an hour and a half without losing concentration is pretty astonishing. Not the right principle move E4, but I'm playing it with a beam board. Let's trade the bishop. Let's trade the queens because he's got a backward pawn. Ooh, I've just seen an idea here. So make sure I push so I don't hang the back rank. Actually, this is dangerous, isn't it, though? Ooh. He's just walked into a checkmate, I think. How the hell is he not checkmated? Oh! Yeah, again, I just couldn't play quick enough. How on earth I didn't have a win there, I don't know, but I'm just not quick enough with the mouse, not quick enough. But how these players play that well, I don't know. Oh, is that Grishuk playing? I wonder if it is the Grishuk playing there, or it's somebody with a similar name. Oh, 2185, good luck. I've really blundered this one, but not to worry. My takes. Let's not just give a free rook away. Oh, I blended the queen. Just from the queen. Hmm. Yeah, I'm losing my concentration a bit on. I'll have to start giving myself slight breaks between games. I'm still doing very well. Two to four, eight, good luck. Oops, let's hope I don't start slipping with the mouse.
Okay, we'll take. Mm. Okay, I'm gonna suck the pawn. Okay, I'm to play that. I've almost trapped my queen. I've got a square. off the board. I need Bishop up if I can get it but then he can pin me. He just got Rook across, I'd already seen it. Oh, I meant to go there, then that was a mouse slip. That was just a pure mouse slip. Unbelievable. Clearly I have to pre-move, no other option. Oh, he did blunder the stalemate, wow. All I could do there was try and play against his clock. Right, 20.54, good luck. Yeah, I've only had two title plays so far. But they do tend to be in a little mini league of their own in these type of events. Okay, I can take that. Mm. Check. Why did I do that? Because he can still go there anyway. I don't know what the hell I was thinking of. I could have just took his pawn, I didn't. Oh god, I didn't see it. I didn't see that he was hitting the queen yet. I've lost my concentration on I have jumped off a cliff now. 2177, good luck. Yeah, my concentration has just jumped off a cliff now, sadly. Um, I think I can push there. I'd love him to push and blunder this, of course, but it's never going to happen, is it? I suspect he'd actually like me to take there. Clearly I'm just tossed here. Why did I do this as well? Unbelievable. That is unreal, isn't it? How the hell can I just play that badly? Hmm. Concentration has just gone. 2125, good luck. Take the pawn. He had bishop check. Oops, I missed that, but I'll take another pawn. I've got knight back if I need it. Well, I don't know. Well, maybe, but... Whoa! Oh, he just takes, doesn't he? Again, I didn't even see that either. I just didn't see it. Unbelievable. I just can't even see simple moves now. I didn't even see that either. Didn't see that either. I've just lost the plot completely. 2300, good luck. Again, 
just too completely, utterly worth. Oh, I've done a ruddy pre-move when I meant to stop it. I tried to actually stop it and then did it anyway. Unreal, isn't it? Yeah, what am I doing? No, I'm just going to resign it. 1751, good luck. Yeah, my player's just gone from like, say, a 10 down to a 2 or something. Or like 10 for my level, not a 10 as in anybody's level, but... Okay, my opponent just moved a bit too quick there. Mm, let's take there, get rid of the rook. Oh, queen first. Yeah, he just made a mistake, didn't he? So he's just given up on that one. Okay, I'm taking absolutely no chances. Get rid of the last attacking piece. Excellent. Don't go blundering a silly stalemate. Nineteen seventy-two. Good luck. Let's take the Okay, if he ever pushes I just simply jump across, but I'm gonna hit the bishop and try and do something. Yeah, let's push the Push and threaten to capture. Oops, except we're threatening to lose our queen. Guess take and take, something like this. Now we hit the rook. Let's take, hit the rook. Threaten to take and take. Oh, he's hung the knight anyhow. So rook across is what I want. Try and get rid of one of his dangerous pieces. That's a rook. Right now I'm just going to get rid of the queen. There's no way he can promote. Okay, now that's the way to do it. And I've got Bags of time here, no need to blunder a silly stalemate here. Yeah, I've got pots and pots and oodles of time. Excellent, very good, that was better. <coughs> right, 2150, good luck. Okay, we've had a second player play this now. I think e3 and something like this is what you want to try and build a decent centre and maybe go queen side. I've got to be a little careful on the diagonal here. Got to push and rugby drop back, otherwise I'll just forget it's there. He's going to play g5, I think he does. Okay, I'm going to abandon this pawn. Ooh, that's a bit unfortunate, isn't it?
He's just done me on speed, hasn't he? Just a repetition, or it should be. Oh, I got a win. That should have been a repetition, that one. Oh. Not sure how I won that one. It should have been a threefold. 1993, good luck. Yeah, I'm going to start taking maybe 5-10 second break between games. Try and just maintain concentration. Oh, I meant to go there. See, that was a mouse sub. That was pure mouse control. It wasn't concentration. Mm, let's just play up. No, let's play bishop up. I was going to play a knight across and I've hung that again. I'll give him the rook this time. But at least I'll get the knight back, unlike early when it was just a free rook. Okay, just abandon a pawn, but get counter play. There is no immediate back rank, but there is a bit of a problem. I need to play something like this, or this. This is my big asset if I can get my king in to use it. An enormous if. And that's the problem, he could force it off. So now I'm just lost here. Yeah. Hmm. He's got to be a little careful, he doesn't let my king in too far possible to blunder. Try and get on a dark square. Or maybe the light square. Oh, I've just hung a pawn there. Yeah, I've just blundered completely, haven't I? Should have been a comfortable draw and I've blundered this co Oh, God. Oh, you had a free bishop. Oh, point not for the second. Unbelievable that I'm losing games like that. Not good. Right, 15 or some good. Wow, 1500 in the top 500. Hmm. 1500 gone berserk. That makes me think it's. I suspect it's not really a 1500. Right, it just resigns. Hmm. I suspect that wasn't really a 1500. A 1500 going berserk outrated 700 points when he's actually thought about it. Does make you wonder. Hopefully, everybody's legit, of course. It might well have been, but 1933, good luck. Okay, that's a piece. Okay, he's got a slight technical problem now that he's just very badly off. But that doesn't mean he won't win the game. Doesn't mean he won't win the game. Hmm. Let's push. Let's just push. Again, I have to make sure I make a move. Oh, and I've hung the knight, I've blundered it. I thought I'd blundered the knight there. Oh, he's traded the bishop though. Oh, no, I have hung the knight. Oh. Gave him a free knight, and now he's given me a free rook. Well, that's just crazy chess, isn't it? Oh, I've managed to get my king back. It should be a win now. There's nothing he can do now. Oh, 
work to make sure we can't come back through. And there we go, we get there. Wow. 2162, good luck, but yeah, we both blundered that game. <coughs> hmm. Let's play another Caro. Tempting to take up the charge in it. Oh, why did I do that? Oh, that was very bad. That was very, very bad. Yeah. Cataclysmic. Cataclysmically bad. Is there any way to defend this? I can't play here because of this. Well done, well done. I'd seen it, but I couldn't stop it, so just get on with the next game. 2062, good luck. Mm, let's just hit the bishop there. Oh, he goes all in, okay. I don't think he'll take the bishop, but he might. Okay, he'll have bishop forward. Okay, let's push and drop the knight back. Whoa. So he's allowed me to really open things up. To be fair, it's very wide open for both of us, isn't it? Not just my opponent. It's just as bad for me, really. I'm going to try and play something like this. Bishop up first, though. I'll guard the pawn. I want something like this and then try and push. Definitely close that down. So he's got a pawn and rook across, he's got a pawn and rook takes. Takes. I'm going to try and double the rooks up. But I'm well up on the clock here so I need to slow down. Very happy to trade queens, give up a pawn for that. Hmm. So much for being well up on the clock. Yeah, worth a try. He knew he was out of time, but God, I fluffed that one, didn't I? I won it, but I fluffed it. Hmm. Well, somebody did well there, didn't they? 2070, good luck. Somebody won every single game and stopped. Queen wanders off, I'll take the knight, but I don't think he will. Okay, I will now and I'll grab. Just going to try and push the pawn here. I doubt I'm going to be able to, but it's what I'm aiming for. Hmm... Play queen across. I want to try and get the other rook into play, but I don't actually see how. Let's offer the queen trade. Then I can definitely get behind. With a, If he trades rooks, then it should be good for me. But let's prepare to get behind. I don't mind if he trades rooks, like I say, but no.
threatening a check there. Again, I'm guarding my pawn, so should be comfortable here. Okay, no excuse to fluff this, of course. No excuse to fluff that one. Let's start giving myself just a 10 second break. There's just over half hour to go. <coughs> right. Yeah, still only the two title players, but clearly I'm not playing well enough to really tackle any stronger players, really. 18, 29, good luck. My knight can always drop back here. Oh, that's an odd move. Let's take. Rook across, I can just take. But knight across is a move. Oh, he's hung it. He's unlucky there, isn't he? Let's just take. I should really just trade here, shouldn't I? There's a piece. Yeah, he just gave up there. He just gave up that one. Hmm. Makes you wonder when the low-rated players are going berserk and playing really, really, really quickly. Right, 2070, good luck. Some players are naturally quick. There'll be some players, you know, particularly younger players who are just really, really quick with a mouse. If he moves his rook, I'm taking the bishop. He just hangs checkmate. Again, a bit fortunate with that one. <coughs> 255th, and clearly I'm not going to finish 255th, am I? That's way above where I should be. So 2324, good luck. Hmm, I might have to pause and draw the curtain in a little bit. It's just getting a bit bright in my eyes as well. I'll take and drop the knight back there. Have I got a check? I doubt it. No, I think I need to just trade. If he trades, I think I queen first with a check, so he can't trade. I think I'm going to be at least level. Oh, why did he move his king again? That was stupid, he just blundered it. He didn't need to move his king a second time. 
Mmm, very lucky. Yeah, I'm just going to quickly move my, draw my other curtain in just, it's a little bit bright. Mm, actually, I'll put the light on there. I'll have the room light on there. Get the room light on. It's the middle of the afternoon, but this time of day the sun comes around right now where my window is, so it's a bit bright in my eyes. So even though I've I haven't put the room light on, it's actually a bit less bright in my eyes. Because the room light is actually behind me, just up above there, but just behind, so it doesn't shine in my eyes. So let's get back to the tournament. 206, wow. There, there's some players like that. Virtually no losses, so they're really doing seriously well. 2 three, three. Oh, good luck. Now, clearly my opponent there was... Going berserk against everybody. You could see he did it instantly. Well, let's just play a queen up there. Let's push. Oops, I've allowed that there. He should have just pushed there, of course. Oh, I've given him a free rook. Why did I take that? I didn't even mean to do that. That was just an autopilot move. 2375, good luck. See, I'm 4 0 down to this opponent, so let's try and correct that. Doesn't mean I will, but I'll have a good go. Okay, he plays the retty. Play up there and take. Um, I'll play rook across first, then bishop up. I'm going to push there. I'm going to go for this. Again, it might be fundamentally bad, but I'm going to go for it. Ooh. Play rook across. Play queen up. I need to play something like this. Oh, I blundered checkmate. Again, as soon as I made the move, I'd seen it. As soon as I moved, I'd seen it. Right, 22.55, good luck. Let's just play pawn up there. Take the knight if he moves, which he does. Ooh, I'm going to go for this one as well. Oh, I've given him a fork now. What the hell am I doing? Let's play knight across. Okay, they have to sack the piece there. There's no point in playing on and not sacking. Yeah. Some games you're better off just getting the, the loss out of the way and getting on with the next one. And just try and save your focus for games like this. When you're playing, players are a bit too good for you, but they're the ones you want to enjoy. Players will play at another level. Just play a pawn up there, and a queen up. Ooh, I think I can take that. Let's play a knight back. Right, I'm gonna sack. Mm. Let's play a queen across, bishop up. Okay, I can't play a bishop up, I might be getting trapped instead. I wanna play a bishop up and get his bishop off the board. Mm. 
actually, why the heck did I do that? Another one, point something of a second, couple I've lost like that now, but okay, 2771, good luck. You can't beat yourself up when things go wrong, you just go on with the next game. Okay, let's push. Well, that doesn't feel right, let's push. Going for the check there, get rid of his bishop. Oh, let's play up and up. I could play a knight in. Ooh. Let's play rook across. Yeah, managed to play that one well enough. I was playing the clock there. I was playing more against the clock than just the position that one. <coughs> right, 2028, 20, good luck. Oh, he's doing really well, isn't he? 263rd. He's obviously deciding whether to go with the guy. Oh, he's 2297 blitz, so I suspect he's underrated here. So let's hope it's just one of them things and not deliberate. Clearly he's very underrated here, very underrated. Make sure I give myself a move to avoid the back rank. If he takes the pawn, I just check and his rook's coming off.
Oh, I meant to go there then. Again, that's another ridiculous mouse slip. What a garbage mouse slip. There is potential matey though. I've covered the bishop going back. But that was just my mouse control. It wasn't anything else. But I think it's mate next move. Yeah, so we get another win. <coughs> 250th with 20 minutes left. But look at all these players. I mean, I'm not going to play any of these. You generally, the system tries to match up against players similar position as well as your um, own rating. Like 2, 4, 8, 3, good luck. play up and trade there potentially. Ooh, that's nasty. I have to take first. Mm. Let's play queen up. I'm going to play rook right the way across. I want this, but I don't want this. So let's drop the queen back. Okay, now we get knight across. Yeah, this is what he's targeting. I can see his idea, but he's traded. Now I can target the pawn. Okay, I can actually take that. really flopped this overnight. Oh, I didn't realise what the clock was there. I didn't realise I was so far down on the clock. But So I mean, anyone who's genuinely quick with a mouse, I just cannot compete with them. I think I've done very well overall, though. I've got 50 points. So that's really, really good. 2 to 11. Good luck. Okay, he's gone berserk. Let's check and drop back. Mm, let's just take again, again and again. And if I get castled, I'm doing fairly well here, I think. Queen back. Either rook across is obviously cleanly winning, depending on what he does. But wow, that's excellent, isn't it? That's excellent. Mm. Of course, he went berserk, so you can see he was playing comfortably quicker than I was, but that's the risk and reward of going berserk. All right, two, one, three, nine, good luck. Hmm. I'm going to let him take here. Okay, let's take... Well, I'm going to castle and still let him take. Okay, I can't obviously um, take there. I think I have to take there, even though I'm hanging this. I might just take and trade the queens, and it takes some of the risk out. Although the clock's what I should have played here, of course. Hmm. Oh, 
Oh, he's connected my pawns. I wasn't in the square, was I? Unbelievable. I am now. I did well to salvage that one again. He did really well, didn't he? Right, 2152, good luck. Take a knight if he pushes. Let's play a knight up. Just drop back. Mm, I think rook across. I don't know why I did that though. Not a good square for the rook. Got the night check, but I can sidestep. Oh, I've hung the night. What did I do that for? Now I've just hung everything. Unbelievable. There is no excuse for hanging it like that. 1981, good luck. get to this I don't actually see I get to it by trading it so it has to be something like this now you have to go for this night up is strong just take don't I bishops pinned if I get castled, I'm clearly winning, but it doesn't mean I'll win. Yeah, don't go there and hang this like I did earlier on. But knight across is strong. I'm just trying to castle. Right, I've castled. Now maybe rook up, rook across. I was aware of the clock there as well. So that was a good win. The top seven make it through, don't they? Yeah, is that Sasha Grishuk? Probably is with the rating, isn't it? Right, 2126, good luck. I'm 
trying to take here. Why didn't I just bail a ruddy queen out there as well while I had the chance? Okay, give him the knight. Now he just takes a piece anyway. What the hell am I doing? I've just lost the plot. Just free piece, just take it. Nothing I can do. Just trade the queens that I can't really do. Have to go forward. move well done I've seen it I just couldn't stop it was oh, that Niels Grandilius I don't know the names of a lot of these players mm, 2099 good luck Bishop up. Take the knight if I double his pawns. Okay, you'll have it. Um, let's just sidestep and try and play something like this. Hmm. Clearly, I can't afford the castle there um, to exchange queens. I need something like this. the bishop, hit the pawn, threaten pawn up. Well, if he takes back, he takes the bishop, he's just lost an exchange. Um, Really good move that cut in my rook. Oh, that's an even better move. Oh god, I blundered it. How the hell did I blunder that? Oh my goodness, I did all the hard work and then blundered it. That is unbelievable, isn't it? All the hard work and then blundered it. Not to worry. 26, good luck. Okay, going berserk, that's what I want. To be fair, I could really do with everybody going berserk against me. Okay, that's a pawn. Let's get rid of his annoying bishop. Let's play a knight in. Give him an easy out rook across. Whoa, that feels like a mistake. Now I can't afford to trade. Oh, he lost the. He did a mouse slip, didn't he? There. I 
Excellent, very good. That was a little bit better. Time for two or three more games. The 1950, good luck. Yeah, I could do with all my opponents going berserk. Gives me a better chance. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. I meant to move the e-pawn, not the f-pawn there. That was a complete mouse slip as well. Hit the pawn, hit the pawn. Complete mouse slip playing f3. I meant to move the e-pawn. See, I can not pre-move an on persant there because he doesn't have to take. I'm actually still in a lot of difficulty here. Knight takes, can I take? No, I can't, so it's castle. Alright, now I'm a bit better. But he's still got plenty of time. Okay, he forces the trade. He's got bags of time here. Why the hell did I do that? Yeah, I'm just going for the mate here. I'm aware he can take the d2 pawn. But if he does it, let's my rook in. Hmm. And now I'm kind of stuck. Now I'm just hopelessly lost. Unbelievable, isn't it? It is unbelievable that you can lose games like that. I don't know how I do that. Should never ever lose a game like that, but well done. Right, 2 1 5 1. Good luck. This might be the last game. There might be time for one more. Okay, go to one of these attacking lines. Unbelievable, isn't it? Oh, I've hung the rook. He had the rook. He had queen takes rook there. Oh, I've hung the checkmate. Unbelievable. I did all the hard work then hung the ruddy checkmate. Unreal. I'd seen it as well. Yeah, talk about losing your concentration. 2 2 1 6. Good luck. This is definitely the last game now. Again, pure concentration now. And why the hell did I do this as well? I haven't got the foggiest clue. She why did he do that as well? Hmm. Oh, why did I do that? Even worse. Oh, it's unreal. It's an absolute calamity of errors, isn't it? 
It's just a calamity of errors. Oops, no pre-move there. But I can't even move my knight away anywhere. Oh, I've hung the rook now. Just giving him a free rook. Oh, he had this. Now he's got this, but I can take the bishop. But it's just an absolute calamity of errors. Wow, how lucky was that? Right, the queen's off. Safe pre-move, couldn't be attacked. Wow, got there. The time had run out, but at least I finished with a winning note, so I kept my 2200 rating. Wow, that's excellent. It's well above my starting position, isn't it? I was about 500 at the start, wasn't I? Somewhat like that. So in the end, I finished 334th out of 2,979 in a tournament like this. Unbelievable. Wow. So I've put in a 2138 rating performance. My average opponent 2132, so it must be about 50%. I've won one and lost one against title players. So it won't let me go right back to the very first game there. It doesn't quite go far enough back, but I should be able to work it out, I hope. Hmm. I can count the gains manually after the event, but it only goes back to game three, but I can check on my video after the event, so I'll just count it up um, after the event and see what the scores are.